Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about Pluto return to the same degree that was 250 years ago when the United States were announced a democratic country and was a new constitution developing. So um, everyone knows those historical um, events and can go and read about it. But I will tell you in two words that it is a time when humans were taken seriously by another humans. In the United States, in Constitution, it says that all people are equal. Well, back then, they said all men are equal. Men meant people. Unfortunately, women were not equal at all at that time and were not equal for another 200 years, which is horrible. And uh, that was um, the, the thing that people did not see. People did not see because they were uh, trying to be angelic-like, God-like, but actually were like devil and denied many people their freedom all the world was in colonies, oppressed poor countries, and women were oppressed in every country on earth. However, in um, U.S. Constitution 1776, all men were declared equal in their pursuit of happiness, and all men were deserving liberty, so means freedom. However, it was not true. Now, in um, January 2022, Pluto will return to the same 27 degree of Capricorn, will, will return to the same spot where in the United States all men were announced free of oppression and free to pursue their quest for happiness and all men were declared equal. So it did not happen. It did not happen through all of these years. Pluto returned to the same spot, reminding all of us that uh, it's time to wake up. <laughs> it's time to wake up to save the earth because Pluto represents underworld and wealth of the world, wealth in um, resources, earthly, natural resources that we overused and it's just a final call for everyone final call for all countries who are greedy and um, all people who are greedy using natural resources and re returning to the same spot where men are not equal women were never equal natural resources are exhausted on our planet and this is a shame to human race. <laughs> Two words, right? Uh, however, Pluto reminds us of um, seriousness of this moment and telling us so we can still do something about it, right? It reminds us the power of nature on this earth. We are nothing if we don't have natural resources. We are nothing if, if we don't have oxygen, atmosphere, atmosphere. Uh, we are nothing if we don't respect um, liberty <clears throat> and pursuit to happiness of every human on earth. Sounds like pathetic, but this is so, so true. We are given another chance, in my opinion, like astrological opinion from um, year 2022 to year 2024, when Pluto enters sign of uh, Aquarius. It will start entering it in March 2023 and will complete entering it in April 2024. <clears throat> we have to be really, really trying hard for these two years to change something. Our banking system is failing. Rich become richer, poor become poor. There's something else has to be done. Human race is so intelligent. We definitely can invent better ways of preserving our natural resources, 
to be equal about money and transparency that cryptocurrency started, crypto chain started many years ago, but still um, there is a big war about holding power. As astrologer, I'll tell you that in the next two years, we will see huge changes. We will see huge changes in everything, starting with electrical cars, with um, cryptocurrency, uh, with us value everything that we have, everything that is natural, from natural food to natural air to natural exchange of uh, goods, exchange of energy that people meant to be honest and don't oppress other people in order to get ahead with their own life plans. We all will face this um, spiritual quest to our own freedom. Our own freedom is our inside freedom that everyone is free. But if we go and push our freedom on other people, we definitely oppress people of other others, uh, freedom of others. And this is why I, I strongly believe that the whole world has another chance to stop to oppress other people, to stop to earn greedy, dirty money by lying, corrupting, and using energy of other people. I strongly believe that everyone has to ask deep in their soul, inside of their soul, what are you doing? What are you doing for the planet? What are you doing for yourself? And what are you doing for other people? For yourself, definitely you want to be happy. And for other people, definitely you want to not to prevent other people's happiness. And for the planet, you have to use this earth lightly. We all can make choice what we buy for food or for clothes or for fuel or for anything in our life. How this um, was done, what labor was used and in which way. We have to ask ourselves, each one of us in our heart, is it clean money, spiritual money, or is it dirty money? And make a choice. It's not about you. It's about the whole humanity. Will this earth still be the most beautiful planet in all the galaxies? I do believe that there are other galaxies with other life expression, but there's none like our earth. There is no other place in the whole universe, so beautiful and so forgiving and so um, pleasant to live. This is why Pluto asks you to return, to return to Earth all that was taken in vain, to return to Earth all that was taken by force, by greed, by corruption, but by lies, by dirty, dirty, dirty approach to life. Pluto puts everyone on, um, like, like in court, to you know, to answer, to answer those simple questions. What you will do next? Okay, what's done is done. We cannot go and redo it. But what do you do next? It's quest for everyone. Pluto is an energy, of course. It's an energy of this question. Do you choose life or otherwise? For yourself and for, for future genera generation, I would say, for Earth and so forth. We don't want to go to Mars. It's not for us. It's, it's, it's a deserted, horrible place. It's like hell. 
that was described in Bible. We don't want to go to Mars. We want to live on Earth, on this beautiful planet. And Pluto makes you conscious. Those two years are important to decide. What do we do next? Please leave comments because it is very important that you um, freely give yourself a chance to speak your truth. Speak your truth. And um, my comments are open for, this, uh, for future discussion. I will uh, see you later. Wish you well. And um, see you again. Bye for now.